Hello everybody, I'm meteorologist Gerard Bailey. I'm sure you all have been seeing the news about the tragic events that happened over Table Rock Lake and I wanted to give everyone a timeline of the weather events that occurred at that point in time just because this is a very much a weather related incident. So we're going to take you through it all right now. First thing to note is that there was a severe thunderstorm watch issued for that area starting at 11.30 in the morning. So severe thunderstorms are already a, a good possibility for that area. We saw some of those thunderstorms here in our own area, and this is what they looked like at the time. Now, this is five o'clock. There they were. We had severe thunderstorms moving through parts of Butler down towards Nevada. This is the cluster that actually produced those wind gusts that they saw over the lake. So let's step ahead in the timeline now. Here come the thunderstorms approaching the lake. At 632, we can see this yellow box. That is a severe thunderstorm warning in effect, which includes the location where the event occurred. Stepping forward now, almost 30 minutes later, which is quite a long time to have some warning time, this right here out in front of the storm is the leading edge of those gusty winds. So I'm sure the winds really picked up at this point and uh, from the timeline, we do understand that the sinking occurred sometime around 7.10 in the evening. But notice the winds are ahead of all the heavy rain. So you can still get those severe wind gusts at that time. Now let's step ahead a little bit further. This is now at 7.23. The heavy rain has moved over the lake. We did get a wind gust reported from a weather station there of 63 miles per hour in the town of Branson. So we do know for a fact that there were severe wind gusts measured at the ground from just that one weather site right there. If you wanna see another full timeline of all the events that occurred, you can go to kshb.com.